How big of a difference is training at uh, Greg Jackson's gym made? Oh man, that was monumental to where I am right now. Monumental training with Greg. Uh, just wonderful person to be around. I thought I was crazy. He's crazy. He's nuts. You, he acts quiet, but he's not. Do you feel like you wish he had done it sooner, or do you just feel like it's the right time? Or You know what? When the student is ready, the master will appear. You know what I mean? So uh, it's uh, it's just part of the game. I, I wouldn't have been ready. Wouldn't have been ready. So what was it after you retired? What was it that brought you back? You know, first, I, was, I, I wasn't watching any fights. I didn't even look at the uh, UFC for a year and a half. And I remember sitting down, and it was, it was Verdum and Hunt, and I'm like, One's 39, one's 40, and I'm and I'm 36, 37. I'm like, what? What excuse could I possibly come up with to not go in the ring? Because I always kept myself out of the gym because I get such good results. I knew I would be back in the gym, and it was, you know, it was a no-brainer at that point. I'm like, I love this stuff. I gotta get in. Something's missing. What did Dana say when? when did you call him or? You know, I texted Dana. I said, Dana, I want to fight again. I want to show everybody who the real. Uh, who the real hero in the UFC is, and he texts me back, are you crazy? Are you crazy, BJ? I go, no, I'm not crazy, I'm ready. So, uh, you know, here we are today. We see you out here with Jason. How much work were you able to get in with him? Me, and, this? me and Jason worked out a ton for this fight, and, and even for the fight before. We, we uh, got together and we started doing a bunch of stuff, so I've been going back and forth with Jason and Greg Jackson and Mike Lukochow. Is that a setup that you kind of almost wish that you would have done earlier in your career? Or this kind of getting to these big camps and these big things. You know, um, like like uh, I wasn't ready at that time, but uh, you know, it's just me and Jason known each other so long. When you know each other so long, and become friends. You stop listening to each other, and uh, that's part of the game. But you come back at an age like this, and like okay, I, so even if he's like, hey man, it's a good place to eat, I listen. Really, huh? Okay, I'll go try it. You know, so people don't just speak to waste their breath, especially especially when they get older. How are you feeling?